Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I would like to show you Outriders running on Xbox Series X. Now this game just released literally today and is available on Xbox, uh, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, uh, Xbox Series S, X and PlayStation 5 and PC. So pretty much a proper multi-platform re release. Now this game uh, got a demo a month ago and you know it was a fun to play with it a little bit here and there. Now we can enjoy the full game. And I must say that I'm actually quite enjoying this game although you know it's a bit challenge challenging at times. Um, and um, the, the gunplay mechanics is actually pretty fun and you've got these special abilities. But before we get into the uh, the gameplay side of things. I wanted to talk about the technical side of things. This game run, uh, runs at 4K 60 frames per second on Xbox Series X. It might be dynamic, but it's very sharp and everything. Uh, one thing to note is that uh, this game has been finally fixed on Xbox Series X because the demo on that console on Xbox, uh, on Xbox Series X was running at like 50 to 55 frames per second, right? That's not the case anymore. It's a smooth 60 frames per second. Um, I don't know, maybe there are some dips here and there. I didn't notice any, to be honest with you, right? It's like very smooth gameplay now. Um, obviously, 4K, the, you know, the graphics is very sharp and everything. Now, um, in terms of the actual art style and, you know, like the quality of graphics, it's not the best looking game ever, but it looks decent. It looks very good. Um, you know, if we I were to compare it to any game, I mean, uh, you know, the gameplay mechanics is very similar to Gears, so I would say it's nowhere near to Gears standard in terms of graphics. But the gameplay is fun. It's like I said, it, it's a bit challenging at times, uh, especially when you play solo. I did play that game solo. I need to check that out in co-op. I'm sure that's going to be obviously easier to do. Uh, but, you know, so far I've been enjoying this game a lot. Can't really say anything bad about it. And, um, you know, just wanted to show you how that plays because like um, it's a not it's not an open world game because it, it's uh, it's uh, at the ver like I thought that it, it was um, an open world game, but it's not. You've got this hub. You have to you've got loading screens uh, between um, uh, missions and different kind of areas and stuff. You've got a map here and there. Um, so let's just take a mission and I'll show you how the uh, how's the gameplay is like. I did stream that game yesterday, so you can, you can actually check a lot, check that out as well. Um, the gameplay is gameplay mechanics is pretty fun. It's uh, you are using combination of you know your guns and um, abilities. Uh, I ch I I you I'm using uh, Pyromancer and um, I'm enjoying it a lot um, you know it's, uh, it's very fun to play boom so uh, by the way every single time you kill an opponent uh, using your abilities um, it restores a little bit of your health uh, oh I didn't notice this guy Yeah, I need to be more careful. Anyone around? No. So yeah, I I'm I must say I'm enjoying the, this game quite a lot, and it's fun because like the gunplay is very similar to um, Gears a little bit, uh, because obviously in Gears you don't have the superpowers. I guess you could you could say that um, you can use um, this uh, robot and stuff, but that's not the same because you can just set people on fire; they blow up. Uh, <laughs> so it's it's just fun, really, right? Uh, obviously, um, I'm still very early in in the game, so you know I can't tell much, say much about like you know the full really. You know, it, it is a full release, but you know, I can't say how the how the game is going to play later on, right? Um, Jesus.
Hide. See, every single time I use my powers and I kill somebody with my powers, I get a little bit of extra health. Uh, which, as you can see, um, I hate these snipers. Snipers are not fun. And you know what I found? I'm um, not sure if that's only me, but I noticed that you know sometimes when I'm behind the in in a cover, sometimes um, I don't get back to the cover. I'm being exposed, which is obviously not nice. So I, yeah, I get shot a lot sometimes when I use powers. Look, I use the power, and there we go. It's it's not hiding. It's not going. It's not going back to the cover anymore. Oh, there's a cave over here. Okay, let's use it to restore some health. One man down. Look how he explodes. There we go. Ooh, sniper there. Need to be careful. See, he didn't... Boom. Why don't you just die? Yeah, sometimes they go back to their cover, sometimes they don't. It's, it, it's annoying, right? Because I never know. You know, sometimes I I think they will and then, you know, I, uh, I end up being exposed. So that's not nice. Um, I can imagine that playing with, you know, in co-op with other people is probably more fun. Uh, so, yeah, I need to gather some people you know to don't run you can run you can hide no, you can run but you cannot hide so that's how they s oh he evaporated anyway don't worry I think that was the last guy. There we go. Yeah, so uh, like you see, um, the gameplay is like similar to Gears a little bit because you have to hide behind behind these barriers, and you can literally see how many of these you know uh, blocks of concrete you've got on the battlefield. Oh, I've got some nice stuff. Yeah, obviously looting is very important because like, you know, abilities are fun to use, but on top of that you have to, you know, get yourself a better weapon and uh, gear, um, you know, to make this game a little bit easier. Um, so yeah, the grind is really in this game, especially when you play solo like I do. So, you know, like this mission I did three times already just to get some better equipment and stuff. And if we go to the, um, over here, yeah, I don't see any better weapon. I mean, I've got the sniper rifle, but I'm not interested in this one. 
there's before oh there's an this is better and boots no no boots yeah la so guys you know that's the game it's um you know it's kind of like it's a mi it's a mix of gears and destiny i would say right i mean um so i'm i'm having fun i know that in order to progress further down in in the game and to carry on playing solo i will have to upgrade and grind a little bit level up um so that's understandable uh but you know generally speaking the the gameplay mechanics is fun once you figure out how to move between these covers and stuff i mean if you played gears this game is going to feel like home <laughs> i'm not joking right so you know and it's and it's really good it's fun and runs great on xbox Series X. i i it also runs very well on other consoles for what i've heard so yeah test it out it's on game pass it's uh, game pass uh, on xbox so check it out so thanks a lot for tuning in. thanks for support really appreciate that and i will see you all in the next one take care